Hello everyone. Hey everybody. So I really wanted to talk about this project I did in my first year in which I got to become friends with people from different countries and we worked on a, a real life problem and we got international business experience. So this all happened in my first year when I applied for X culture. This is an online program which provides you international business experience. If you want to apply for this program, you can go to the website and complete the application form. If your application form get accepted, you will get first four week training. And after that training, you have to take a test. And if you are able to pass that test, they will put you in a team of six to seven people from different countries. And then you have to work on a real life problem. So first of all, let me introduce to you all to my uh, teammates. This is Dana. Hi, I'm fine. Thank you, Kushbu. This is Sabrina. Hello, everyone. I'm Sabrina. Hello, Kushbu. This is Shivani. Hi. This is Rachel. And this is Leah. So after I completed my four week theory, so I got this mail having name of all my teammates with their countries and their mail. So it took us nearly three days to get on one platform because some never used WhatsApp. They're like using Messenger or Line. And then eventually we all ended up on WhatsApp for informal communication. So it was really fun and different experience for me because I don't have many friends from different countries. We got to know about each other's culture, language, and there were a lot of differences as well as similarities. So I texted all of them so that they can be part of this video. So we were able to connect on a Zoom meeting with Dana and Shivani and Leah was busy with her modeling stuff and Rachel was actually sick. Sabrina was a bit busy so she sent a short video recording for me. So Sabrina is from Taiwan and she is right now preparing for her college entrance exam. Okay, so let's first see what Sabrina wants to say. Hello everyone, I am Sabrina. Hello, Kushbu, oh, I miss you so much. Sorry, I'm a little bit busy so I can just send you the videos uh, however I'm very glad that in, you invited me as a part of your video I'm so happy today I'm gonna share about my experience and interesting part in our X culture global virtual team I think my go I think my experiences in X culture were tired but meaningful and fantastic just like sweet burden I love the theory test before doing the uh, report. I learned a lot from the information as culture provided, such as pricing and how to deal with free rider, <laughs> yeah, and, and so on. They are useful and interesting. I also love the webinars as culture provided, because they would invite so many intelligent and professional professors um, from every field to taught us how to conduct the research and how to complete our project or you know how to fix the conflicts we usually use whatsapp to interact with my team members sometimes we could share our life to to one another for the purpose for the purpose of being closer uh, we would also introduce the culture of our own countries to to the teammates such as holidays thank you and so on. That, that's very interesting and that helped me a lot to expand it, my region. People in my team were very, very friendly. When some of us come in, got into trouble in school exams or making reports, everyone will encourage them and try to figure out how to help them. By doing so, we have developed a sense of a trust between us. I think that's a most important factor. I think that was the most important factor that we could complete our report successfully in the end. Okay, at last, I want to thank you. Thank you guys. You know, you really helped me a lot. And, you know, you support me when I felt frustrated. And I really treasured and I really missed, I really missed the time we worked together. Okay, that's all. Thank you. Bye-bye. I miss you too, Sabrina, and also all the best for your exam. So after that, so after this, I had a fun session with Shivani. She is from Trinidad. And let's see.
Hi. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. You? I'm also good. Uh, can you read your phone? Oh, okay. I'll make better. Yeah. Okay. That's not. Tell some good moments or like fun facts that you learned or gained about with this experience. Well, to be honest, I didn't expect it to be like this. I thought it would have been awkward at first. But I feel like with our group, we kind of moved. I don't know. We kind we kind of clicked. Yeah, we connected. Like, like yeah, we kind did. Of like it didn't have any awkward had. seasons. Yeah, we yes, that's true. For this short period of time, we we worked together. It was really good. I wish I could have put in more time. Yeah. But I, nevertheless, it was it was really well. How you know um, so much about Indian culture and all? Okay, well, in Trinidad, majority. Well, not majority, but like I would say half of the population is East Indian. So like we back to history and everything. Um we had Indians like from India coming down to Trinidad as indentured laborers and that kind of where everything happened. But yeah, we it's kind of something I grew into. So yeah. You also told me like uh, you uh, like some Indian movies a lot. So Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who's okay. your favorite actor? Yeah. Uh, for now on. For now on. Yes. <laughs> um, maybe, well, Indian movies. It would be like Kalank or Idol Hai Mushkil. Well, yeah. <laughs> That's like the, the main ones I kind of really like. So, I really like uh, Idol Hai Mushkil. Like, it is a good movie. Yes, oh my god. <laughs> Uh, so, thanks a lot for like joining in and giving your time. I know you were a lot busy. And <laughs> <laughs> and is there anything like you want to tell uh, uh, all the people like watching my channel? Well, concerning X culture, um, it's very fun. You should use it to the best of your opportunities. I mean, it it not want it's not. maybe once in a lifetime but is a very rare opportunity yeah. only if you get true to do it and i find i i really thought like i wasn't sure if i was going to get true to do it but make the best out of it just and connect with people the this ex culture group the main reason why i love it so much is because i got to talk to people halfway across the world yeah so far away from <laughs> me and I, it was so nice i just i love it so much So thank you so much Shivani joining in. Thank you. Thank you for having me. <laughs> and uh, all the best for your exams and I hope you get your <laughs> get the best grades and yes, stay safe. Yes. You too. You too. Yeah. Okay. Bye. <laughs> bye bye. And after this finally I talk with Dana. She is from Jamaica and she have her own YouTube channel and a online learning platform called Cadre Bag and all the links to her channels are in description below you can check it out and let's see Hey Dana how are you Hi I'm fine thank you Kushbu how are you doing I'm great it's been so long Yes yes definitely <laughs> a few months probably 5 yeah so. <laughs> Are you in touch with other teammates? Yes, I I have been keep in touch with them. Um they're just exceptional people and I'm so glad to have met them during the Exculture project. So, um I'm recording this video because I wanted to share my like experience Exculture experience with all my mates. I wanted to share that what is this program about and how I got to know about it and what all we learned because like this is so grateful experience for me. uh getting to know so many amazing people from different countries and like getting this international experience and like waking up at 4 am for the meetings and all <laughs> yeah or going to bed super late yeah <laughs> these are really fun things and uh, we really enjoyed our 6 months together yeah. let's do this <laughs> all right <laughs> so exculture is basically an international business competition where youth from around the world collaborate in gbts yeah. and kushbu you know gbt is a global virtual team you work with a real life companies on real life business problems 
that people face in their industry. And we, as young people with brilliant minds and bright ideas, come together and help the business um, solve that particular issue. So it was, it was indeed a great experience. And it was um, great to actually, as Buzz Taurus would say, you can't learn how to swim on a football team on a football <laughs> field. You have to get into the water. Yeah. So absolutely. a lot of people they don't really know what they're getting into if they want to do international business or work with people around the world. So it gave us that experience, a real life practical experience. Wouldn't you say so? Yeah, actually, like I would never like imagine how difficult it will be for me to like uh, connect with different people from different companies and like collaborate with them until I like, got into this program. I got to know like different time zones and we have to like we are uh, we have different languages and we ha we have different lingos and we have to like yeah, accents, learn everything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we have different accents and we have to accept and we have to like change with them. We That's can't true. be rigid. Mm -hmm. And now I know, like, I have different people around with me. Uh, around the world, yeah. I yeah. was indeed yearning for the experience because I really love learning um, about different languages and cultures. In fact, I speak four different languages. I speak Mandarin, English, French, Spanish. So to find other people would be kind of difficult. Yeah. And I had a friend who, he saw an ad on Instagram. And at the time, I wasn't on Instagram. And he said, Come then, I'll come and, and, and look on this website, xculture.org. I think uh -huh. you should apply for it. So I, I just went for it and I got in. And I was put in a group of six people, six girls, in fact. And I yeah. think that it wasn't by design. It's supposed to be um, mixed up, of course. You have to be put um, with people from different countries. But yeah. I was expected to get a group of all girls. <laughs> and I was like, wow, that's so interesting. Because by the names, you cannot tell um, the gender of the person. Yeah, actually. so I was like, whoa, it was just so coincidental that we had, had a group of all girls and then we got along so well. I had no qualms with you guys. Yeah, actually, like, uh, unless you don't know the people around the world, you don't know actually that what can, what are the possibilities that uh, what can be happening there. Uh, like, when I got to know, like, Sabrina is uh, preparing for her entrance exam for six mm -hmm. months and she is not allowed to use phone and uh, <laughs> mobile phone. I was like, uh, why, like, this happens? And she's like, this is normal, we have strict parents. And, and she also told us now that she have 12 hour long classes and I was like, what? <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, yeah. So these different experiences we got to know because we happened to be in this program. And mm -mm. And the fun part is I also got to know about this program on LinkedIn, uh, Instagram only. <laughs> so yeah, on Instagram. Yeah. So one day, like in 2019, when I was like very excited to start my first year, I was one day scrolling my Instagram and got the ad of like X Culture, and the line that gain experience of like international experience that got me like okay let's check it out what is it and then i got to know like you have to work in teams with seven different people and you have to like solve real problems and it was like nice let's apply mm -hmm. for it and and uh, to be honest i applied it for applied three times like in a row so <laughs> I, my first two applications got rejected and then like with every application that got rejected i got to know okay these are the uh, improvements i can do because they also send the improvement mails to mm -hmm. that these are the improvements you can make and finally the last uh, application it got accepted on the last day of the application wow. <laughs> and i was damn happy like oh i have done that and like it was really fun experience then i got to know you all and yeah 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 fun. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I really like the spirit of improvement with X Culture. They don't, they don't expect that you know or assume that you know everything. They yeah. really try to help to build you and boost you and say, "Hey, here is how you did this. This is how you can improve." Yeah, and I like the fact that they they allowed us to get serious with the project, especially um, at the initial stage, because we had a four week theory phase where yeah. we had to study the resources and the materials that they would send on their platform. 
getting to know more about GBTs, as I mentioned before, global virtual teams, getting to know about the concept of international business, what technologies to use, right? And yeah. then we'd, we'd do the test at the end of the week and we'd, we'd patiently await to see if we pass or anything like that. Yeah. <laughs> and then at the end of the test, we'd get a, a weekly evaluation. So we should say, okay, what problems we probably experience with X culture or ways they could improve or things that they, we enjoyed about the project. Um, so I really enjoyed that they were about improvement, they weren't complacent and they really liked feedback. So we're we're going to do a part two to this video on my channel, Curva Card. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so you guys can look out for that. And I, I also wrote up a blog article on my, what the Exposure 29 a challenge taught me. So if you're interested and in looking on how to apply and so forth, you can just keep abreast with this channel and of course my channel and my um, website, of course. I will put all the links in the description if you would like to see them. And <laughs> definitely go check out her channel. And thank you, Dana, for joining in and sharing your No problem. Your it was a pleasure. It was a pleasure. <laughs> Bye. Bye, everyone. So I hope this video was helpful and fun and if you want to apply for Xculture, the link to the site is in description below and the application forms are open right now so you can definitely check that out and if you have any doubt related to it you can ask me in the comment section and thanks for watching bye